There is one simple method to get 4,000 watch hours and 1,000 subscribers. This is by far the fastest method and the most effective method for anyone. Don't waste time elsewhere. Just follow this strategy and your channel will hit the 1,000 subscriber mark and 4,000 watch hours within one week. So what method do I use? I actually use YouTube ads. And if you're wondering why I use YouTube ads, this is because this allows me to hit 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 watch hours from a brand new channel instantly, typically within four days or so. All I have to do is put my video up as an ad. It will get me views. And because I have views on the video, I will gain more watch time. And because I have watch time, I also will gain subscribers. But before you say, don't you have to pay for ads? Yes, you do. But Google actually gives everyone who starts a Google Ads account $100 for free. So this means you can actually use this to generate free views and subscribers to your channel. So for me, it's a win-win. And yes, this method I have actually tested and I've been through the hard effort of spending money on YouTube ads and wasting some, of course. So when I tell you I know what I'm talking about, you can believe me. So if you want to use YouTube ads to grow your channel to hit the monetization threshold, here's what you need to do. Step one, setting up your channel for ads. In order for your channel to be set up properly for ads and for it to actually get the best results, you need to have a good looking channel. You will need a channel banner and a channel icon. Next are the videos. Ideally, you need at least three videos that are highly relatable and are highly watchable and as long as possible, ideally around seven to 10 minutes for each video. Now, the reason you need to have three videos minimum is because here's what happens when you spend money on YouTube ads. A viewer comes into one of your videos. If they like it, they will check out another and another video. So the more videos you have, the more views you can get and the easier it is to build your watch time. So once you have your channel set up and your three videos on the channel with a good thumbnail, you need to head over to YouTube ads. You need to go ahead and click create new campaign. Once you've done this, you will be on this page. And when you are on this page, you need to click create a campaign without a goals guidance. Then click video campaign, then custom video campaign. Now what you need to do is name your campaign. Set the amount to how much you are willing to spend. If you want to hit 4,000 watch hours and 1,000 subscribers, the prices are dependent on your niche. Some niches are more expensive than others. Overall, it cost us $1,000 to get 4,000 watch hours and around 1,500 to get 6,000 watch hours and 1,000 subscribers. Now, this price may seem quite high, but it can actually be a pretty good investment because it now means that once you hit the monetization threshold, you will actually start to earn that money back. And on all my channels, once I had the subscribers and started posting videos, they watched them and I started to make my money back. So now select locations. Depending on your audience or your target audience, you need to select the relevant viewers. For example, if your channel is in English, you need to advertise in all English speaking countries. Now go to languages. Select the language of your content. Inventory type, standard inventory. Ad group, give it a name. Next for the demographics. If you have some statistics, try to exclude the irrelevant viewers. So for me, that's those above the ages of 45 plus and anyone below the age of 17. As for the gender, you can see it's above 90% male. So we will only be advertising to males. Do not select any keywords. Do not select any topics. As for placements, you can use other relevant videos which are very similar to yours. I would suggest looking for videos that have recently been posted in your niche. Once you find these, you add these placements and your video will appear as an advertisement alongside them. For the maximum CPV bid, I would start with five cents and then lower this until you see it starts to affect performance. Then you need to add your video. Be sure to add your video as a video discovery ad. Add the headline, the description. Then name this ad, of course, a name for the ad. When that's all done, click create campaign. It takes 24 to 48 hours for your campaign to go live. 
Once that's done, you need to now add your other two videos. Click on your campaign, then add groups, then click the plus icon, and then add the second and third video just like you did the first one. Once that's done, click on your campaign, then click on ads and extension. Then look at the tab called policy details. This tab will show you if an ad has been approved or not. If your ad has been disapproved, they will tell you why and you can make those changes in order to allow your ad to be approved. You can also view the relevant stats, such as how many subscribers you have earned and how many earned views you have, which means people who saw your ad and then people your other videos. Once you have three ads running, you need to let them run for three days. After three days, you need to look at which ad had the most watch time and then pause the rest. This is so that all of your ad spend goes into the video, which will give you the most return on your investment. If we look here, you can see that it shows how much people will view a video. Then you will just pause the other two ads, which didn't perform as good as the one that did. So now, all your money is being spent on your best performing video.